A roadside bomb in Kabul targeted first Afghan Vice President Amrullah Saleh on Wednesday. He escaped unharmed, but the attack killed at least six people and wounded 12. The bomb exploded as Saleh's convoy drove past. Some of his bodyguards were injured. The Taliban denied involvement in the attack, which comes just ahead of the peace talks between the Afghan government and the Taliban in Doha. Salah appeared in a video on his social media soon after, saying he had sustained a minor burn on his face and an injury to his hand in the attack. The former intelligence chief has survived several assassination attempts, including one on his office last year that killed 20 people. International powers have condemned the attack. The EU delegation in Afghanistan said in a statement that this blast is a, quote, spoiler of peace efforts. Officials and diplomats have warned that rising violence is sapping trust needed for the success of talks, aimed at ending an insurgency that began when the Taliban was ousted from power in Kabul by US-backed forces in late 2001.